Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Stealing 33 Plays Dead Cells. My name is Stealing 33, and today, ladies and gentlemen, I am back right away. Did not take very long for me to get back into Dead Cells. Still recording during the same recording session, um, largely due to the fact that, like, I basically just, like, this is the only time I'm, I think I'm going to really get to, like, record right now. So I want to try to get, like, bang out a couple episodes here um, so I can maybe try to get some shit for you guys. That'd be nice. Really appreciate. Really appreciate getting some stuff done. Mostly because, like, I want to try to, like, if I'm only going to have, like, right now to record, um, you know, I'm going to be a little bummed out. I'm going to have time later in the weeks to, like, get more recordings done. But, like, for, like, the next, like, few days, like, this is, like, the only time I guarantee I'll have to, like, sit down and be like, yeah, I can burn out a couple hours to, like, do some recording. So we'll just do them all at once. It's a smart move, I think. I think so, at least. We'll find out. In which case scenario, it's not a good idea. And, you know, you guys, uh, I get fired. And then I have all the time in the world. So there you go. Not a big deal. Get out of here, nerd. Break your head. I mean, I get three grand to open up that one door because it's got some sort of heart at inside of it. And I don't know what that heart is, but I won't sit. Oh, all oh, those are good. Um, what is this, health up? Hey, health upgrade. Nice. Uh, with a 1,000 gold, we will open this to get the balance blade. I think the balance blade is better than that. It also throws grenades that do damage. Yeah, okay, so like every now and then I'll throw a grenade that'll explode and deal damage. Which is interesting. Yeah, like every now and then I just toss a grenade out apparently. Yeah, that was a that was a solid investment. I'm still hoping we can get three grand to figure out what that telltale heart is. Um the twin daggers are really good. I would really like to get ice grenade. Ice grenade's like super duper good. Um I would very much be invested in getting that item. Even if it means I have to, like, kill everybody. Dead for a while now. He's dead. I mean, I figured that out, but, you know, like, interact with his corpse. I want his loot. Hopefully, I hope we get enough dead cells where we can afford to get the broadsword, because I'd like to try that out if we can. Although, it would make buying this item, like, the this thing bad because uh we'd have to swap it out but we'll see that heart seems cool hopefully we'll get enough gold to get that um i think if i'm diligent and if i'm pretty lucky we'll be able to get enough gold for that well there's also an upgrade over here it's a malachite the yeah, strength upgrade's great i'm actually like pumped to have that ow ow Ow. There we go. Easy does it. Don't use the sword for ranged attack. You have a bow. Use that. I don't know what that is, but I won't sit. It looks like a sturdy shield, judging by the, the icon. Slash, it's a sturdy shield, judging by the icon. Um... Double slash, I'm like 90% sure it's a sturdy shield. I learned the opposite of low key today. Hey, what is this? What do we got? Something cool, something cool, something cool. Electric whip. Uh, 100 damage on burning targets. Join the dark side. I think we'll take it and we'll swap the bow out for it. Yeah, there we go. Cool, cool. Hopefully that's not garbage. Firebrands. Okay, so like basically if we do it like, no, I want it like, uh, I want this here and this here. So basically like we light them on fire with the, this thing. What up? Ooh, uh, scroll of, take one little hit and you're dead. Eliminate 10 enemies to lift the curse. Oh, that's a, uh, that's not great. Um, I guess we'll do this. What is this? Throwing knife two and a diamond or some sort of sapphire. All right. Uh, guess we'll, we'll be careful. So if we get hit at all, we die. Seems fair. Let's 
go up here. Yggdir Oris Lee is the name of this item up here. Judge, like, I like read it on the map. I don't know if you guys caught that, but it's on the map. It says Yigdar Oris Lee Ox. It's like an ox heart, I think. Let's do it. Saves your life once, does not work against curses. Oh, well, that's... I mean, that's fine. What does this do? Nothing worth mentioning except maybe a vague whiff of dead rat. Okay, cool. So we have a new amulet. Not sure... Not sure what uh, all of this is good for, but... That's where we'll go. I mean, fuck it. We gotta kill ten dudes without dying. Um, I kind of regret not buying the frost grenade, but... We'll see. We'll make it happen. We'll make it happen. I'm decent at not getting hit. What up? What up, weird guy? There's some cells. Does massive damage. Massive damage. I guess we'll invest a little bit more there. A broadsword. Does 100% target damage. Okay, so we can take that over the electric whip. Ooh, that's cool. I'm on board. I'm on board. Let's make this happen. We just can't get hit, so... Like, we gotta be careful, but basically we hit them with the Y, then we hit them with the, we hit them with the X. Smash them up real good. Apparently it does, like, double damage versus enemies that are on fire, so. But if we get hit, we die, so. Hopefully we'll bump into enough enemies, like, straight away and just not have to worry about it. I was like, hopefully there's not, like, a lot of traps, because I'm not the best platformer in this game ever. One enemy down. Two enemies down. Three enemies down. Four. Okay. I'm, like, really nervous. Oh, oh, oh. That. All right, cool. There we go. I'm sure that the the burning effect will probably be significantly more useful for fighting bigger enemies. But so far, I'm enjoying the broadsword. Oh, no! I didn't get my second jump off. <laughs> Damn it. All right, that's all right. We'll go for another one. Oh, no, I dropped my remote. Back remote. Don't escape, you bastard. The prisoner's cell. Not too bad so far. Not too bad so far. 76 gold. Not bad. Alright, sorry. I uh, uh, adjust myself. The seat I am sitting on is not very comfortable, to be honest. Um, it's just straight up not comfortable. Got that, cool. Get out of here, nerds. Get out of here, Skella man. I'm really, I, I like, I'm really excited because like there's so many weapons that I haven't even seen yet. Like there are weapon types that like, I had some twin daggers once that like caused people to it burst into flames when they died, which was really cool. Um. I had like a, we had that sword that did fart gas earlier. You guys remember that? I see the, I see the item. Don't worry, I'm gonna go get it. The item room or whatever. You get like one free item. Which is cool. Electro whip, which we will take. This one seems to shoot something. That's kind of cool. That'll be useful, I think. Fire grenade. Get out of here, nerds. <laughs> I'm actually kind of enjoying the whip. It's a it's decent, it's a decent weapon so far. I'm uh, hoping we'll get a nice secondary, something maybe a little more explodey. Like I would really like to get fire Hadoken again. Get out of here, nerd. There we go. 
I also really like when I have weapons that are really fast because I can float with them a little bit. It's so, like you can like jump in the air and do this. And like if you mash it quick enough, it can like you can float for a hot second, which is like pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure what its practical application is yet, other than the fact that you get to float. But, you know, we'll see. Roll, roll, roll. Do it. I'm on a roll. Haha, <laughs> lol, lol, lol. Secret with some gold in it. Nice. Oh, that's bad. It was just in my hair. Yeah, you're a nerd. Ooh. Get out of here. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. What do we got here? Anything cool? Oh, we got a broadsword. 175% damage to frozen targets. Well, we can't freeze people. But do I like the broadsword more? Let's take the broadsword. I think I prefer a slower, heavier weapon to a fast, low at damage weapon. Like, I think I think I definitely prefer like just smashing the person to death. Take the greed shield over the wooden shield. The wooden shield just doesn't do anything. Is the reason that's a good trade. Um, has very little to do with like the actual thing. I kind of regret buying the. Uh, the broadsword now, because I would have preferred the thing that makes it so that if I die, I don't die. That would have been nice. Got here. That's the flash grenade. That's actually pretty decent. Oh, come on. There we go. Thank you. A kebab. We got a little bit of health back. Nice. Yeah, the health items are few and far between, unfortunately. So, gotta be really careful. The, the healing vials are really, like, only consistent way of, like, healing ourselves. Um, which is, like, fine, because we have it. Like, I'm not sad. I just would really like to maybe not have that. Dead for a while now. Goodbye. So, it's interesting. So, apparently, like, between deaths here, like, time is passing, I guess. Or maybe it's like as we upgrade stuff, time is passing. So we have four cells. Just dump them into our dumping ground. That is the health potion. I'm hoping that like when we upgrade the health potion, it'll upgrade it so that it heals more. And that maybe or maybe it'll give us more charges. That would be nice. Get out of here. I don't open doors, I smash them. Gotta get my smash on. You're smashing it. You're just mashing it. We'll see. Bah. I really wish there was like a downward attack. Like, I know we can do like the downward this thing, but like, I really wish like with my broadsword I could do a downward attack. That would be kind of nice. Ow. Can you catch yourself on fire? Get out of here. So, the problem with the broadsword is that obviously it is very slow. It doesn't matter very much when it kills most dudes in, like, one hit. What do we got here? Shiny rock. For the 140. <laughs> Get wrecked, nerds. I think what I need right now is more strength upgrades like that would be nice or if like agility actually makes us faster like agility upgrade that makes it so that i can swing the broadsword faster that'd be cool i don't know if that's like the, the, the thing that is a thing but maybe it is Out of here, god damn it. Whew. There we go. I see a kebab over here, so a little less salty because I can get healed up. I, I just like I don't like it when the game like just fucks me. Like it's okay when it's like fucking me, but it's my fault that it's fucking me. Like when I jump into an area that like perhaps was not a smart idea to jump into. Get out of here. Get wreck nerd! Oh a chicken leg. Chicken. Smash this, get this. More strength. And you know what I need is I need, like, not a shield. Like, I could get, like, um, 
throwing daggers would be good. Um, if I could get, uh, there's an item. Like, I, I, I probably should have taken the whip over, um, over the, uh, what's it called? The shield? Just because, like, the shield's great, but I'm already pretty slow. And I don't think you could shield. Oh, I guess I can shield cancel. Yeah, I guess I can do that. Never mind. I'm just being stupid. I should just be better at this game. I'm just worried. I'm worried about this boss because, like, this boss is really hard. There we go. Get out of here. Vine rune. This rune permanently gives you the ability to grow climbable vines. What up? Give it up. Give it up for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. So now we can tickle, tickle vines to make them grow. Boom. All right, cool. That opens up a lot of possibilities in that first area as well. Um, there are a lot of things in, like that first area we just couldn't get to because we didn't have this ability. This one right here. All right, you can make vines. It's actually pretty dope. I'm actually very excited about this. I'm really happy we killed that boss. It was a lot of like just brute forcing him, but like. You know, what, you know what we can do is, uh, let's hit this. There was like a teleport. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I was like, there was a room where there were vines that we could go in down. That, like we needed this ability for. Boom, there we go. Ha ha. Figured we'd explore a little. Hey, free item. What up? Kick. What is that? Sturdy shield? Sturdy shield blocks, attacks, and stuns the thing, and then shoots grenades at people. We'll take it. Neat. Hopefully that'll be useful as we move forward here. Is there anywhere else that we... Am I hurt? I think I'm hurt. So let's grab this chicken. Uh, yep. Let's grab that. And then let's go here. Boom. Cool. All right. All right. That, that settles it, though, that I think the broadsword is good. I don't know if it's my favorite weapon yet, because it definitely belongs to, like, the fucking ice Hadouken that I could do. Um... I got an ability to like a, a like a round during uh, last night's recordings when I tried to record this. That was basically like I could shoot like an icy Hadoken. That was cool. There you go. You're right. Get out of here. Wrecked. Feeling it. I'm feeling it. You know, I, I these games super super fluid. That hurt my body. What is this? Twin daggers? <sighs> no, because I think I like the broadsword. I think we're doing fine with that. I don't think I need the twin daggers. The twin daggers are good. They're very fast, and um, they do a critical strike at the end, so they do bonus damage um, after, like, four attacks or something like that. I don't remember. I don't remember um, exactly what it was, ah, but um, I remember it was good. Just, um... I don't know. The broadsword's good. I'm enjoying it. It's slow, but who cares when you're fucking one-shotting everything? I think it follows my enter the gungeon motto of the less time I spend near me, the better. There we go. Block that second attack. I still have my potion, so I still have that going for me, which is nice. Like, we're still doing fine, I just... I definitely need something ranged, I think. Like, the, um... I need, like, uh... There's, there's the throwing daggers are probably good. Um, some kind of grenade probably would be fine. Um... Hello! Everything is for sale, huh? Flashbang. When you get gold, you get a dead cell. You get gold when you get dead cells. That's not bad. Plus one skills as well. So I could buy this flashbang three and get plus one skill. Um, I think we'll take this. Um, that seems solid. The plus one skill like by itself would have been worth 3000, but then we also get the ability, like we get the exact thing I'm looking for, which is like something ranged basically help us out a little here so I mean hopefully we'll be 
good. I can get further and further. Yeah, the flashbang will also help us when we um, are dealing with oh, the bad guys here, because we can stun them with a the grenade like that, and then club them to death. Spartan sandals. Nice. Another item that I kept eluding me. Not anymore! Correct. Get out of here. <laughs> I like that the Y is also just like a throw grenade button, basically. It does like very little damage, but it also tosses a grenade, so I'm not gonna... Dam free damage is free damage, man. Alright, what do we got here? Something good, I hope. Perhaps. Alright, so it's definitely gonna be another boss fight. So let's be prepared here. Don't forget that we can we can fucking attack cancel using the shield, so. Here we go! Oh no, it's a... Uh, Hello! Yes, I am back. And I finally managed to turn in the assassin dagger. Inflict a critical blow when you backstab your enemies. Interesting. We have 25 cells. What is this? Kick victims backwards and interrupt their attacks. That might be interesting. I might, I might be interested in that. Uh, increased damage to broadsword seems like it might be decent. Let's do that. That seems good. Bonus damage to broadsword seems good. And then let's like keep putting cells into the healing potion, I guess. Try to make it happen like that. Use this thing to heal up. Grab more potion. Good stuff. All right. I'm hoping that there's a boss fight because I was a little jazzed up for a boss fight. This feels like a boss fight. The ramparts. The ramparts we brave. The bombs bursting in air. They gave proof through the night. A room with a view. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, yeah. So I think this is a boss fight. Or, like, an area that might potentially have a boss fight. Or it's just a new area. That's possible, too. I might just die here, to be honest. There we go. Alright. Easy does it. Just focus up. We'll be, we should be fine, as long as I... I mean, focused, ow. And don't forget that the bad guys shoot ranged attacks. So remember that you can block. Remember that the bad guys do shoot ranged attacks. And we should be okay. Just gotta... Gotta focus. Gotta focus. Bada fuko focus. Let's do it. Doop, doop. Get out of here. I'm really glad, like, the broadsword's super good. Really hoping that we'll be able to have it more in the future. Ow. So if I'm diligent, apparently, that has like a like a Bloodborne style system in it where if I get hit and it doesn't kill me, I can heal if I hit the person. And I did not notice earlier. You can kind of see it like. That's a time gate, so we're not going to be able to interact with that at all. Fucking God knows I've not been speedy. I might try to I might try to do, like, a speed run to get to the first speed gate in, like, the first area. See, like, what that's all about. Oh, that guy's dead as hell. I feel like that's a pit, so we're going to avoid that. That guy's dead as hell. Like, holy shit. So if I hit these guys in the back, they apparently just die instantly, except for this guy, apparently. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. That's all right. It happens. Not a big deal. Uh, but that is going to do it for this episode. So thank you all so much for watching. If you guys like what you saw, let me know. If you guys want to see more, don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date. I'm going to post more videos. If you really like what you saw, leave a like. Helps the channel grow. Helps me out a great deal. But of course, with that, thank you all so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye!